Have you ever wondered about the different types of goats and their unique characteristics? Today, we delve into the fascinating world of goats, exploring four prominent types, the boar, sarnan, nubian, and alpine goats. First up, we have the boar goat, a breed primarily raised for meat production. Known for their muscular build and distinctive white bodies with reddish-brown heads, boar goats are hardy and adaptable. They thrive on good quality forage and supplemented grains, making them well suited to various climates and terrains. While primarily a meat breed, boar does can produce a reasonable amount of milk for their kids. Next, we have the sun and goat, renowned for high milk production. This breed stands out with a white coat and upright ears. A balanced diet is essential for sun and goats to maintain high milk production. They are adaptable to different climates, allowing them to thrive in various regions. Sunans are recognized for their calm temperament and efficiency in converting feed into milk. Our third breed, the Nubian goat, serves a dual purpose, excelling in both meat and milk production. Characterized by long pendulous ears, a Roman nose, and various coat colors, Nubians require a balanced diet to support their dual purpose capabilities. They are known for their distinctive appearance, vocalizations and adaptability to various management practices. Last but not least, we have the Alpine Goat, primarily raised for dairy production. Exhibiting various coat colors, upright ears, and a medium to large size, Alpines require a balanced diet for sustaining high milk production. They are adaptable to different climates, allowing them to be raised in diverse agricultural settings. In summary, we have explored four unique goat breeds, each with its unique characteristics and purposes. The meat-producing boar goat, the high-milk-producing sarnan goat, the dual-purpose Nubian goat, and the prolific milk-producing alpine goat. Each breed has its unique strengths and adaptability, making them valuable assets in diverse agricultural settings. So the next time you see a goat, you might just be able to identify its breed and purpose.